Alphonse Joseph Canantanam born the 8th of August 1953, is an Indian civil servant, advocate, and politician. He is currently serving as the Union Minister of State for Electronics and Information Technology, Culture, and Tourism, in office since 3 September 2017 under the BJP. Government of Narendra Modi. He is the second BJP Central Minister from Kerala after O. Rahagopal. Kanantanam belongs to the 1979 batch of the Indian Administrative Service IAS, Kerala Kadri. He was in Time magazine's list of 100 young global leaders. He pioneered the literacy movement in India by making Khatiyam the first 100% literate town of India in 1989. He served as commissioner of the Delhi Development Authority. Alphonse was born in Manimala, Khatiyam district, Kerala, India, and was a left-front independent member of the Legislative Assembly for Kanjirapali in Khatiyam district, Kerala from 2006 to 2011. He joined the Bharatiya Janata Party in 2011. Early life and education Alphonse was born in Manimala, Khatiyam district, to K. V. Joseph and Brigitte Joseph. His father was a World War II veteran who became a school teacher after the war. His parents had nine children, they adopted two more from the orphanage. Alphonse received his early education in Malayalam medium village schools near his place of birth. He completed his master's in economics from Delhi. Dot and was one of the toppers of the civil services examination in the year 1979. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Career. Alphonse was recruited to the Indian Administrative Service in 1979 and served for 27 years. He voluntarily retired from the service in 2006. He was later elected a member of the Legislative Assembly, from Kanjirapali in Khatiyam district, Kerala with the support of Communist Party of India led Left Democratic Front He is also a practicing advocate in the High Court of Kerala at Kochi and the Supreme Court of India. Alphonse first came into prominence when he served as the district collector of Khatiyam in 1988. He drove the literacy movement in the state and helped to make Khatiyam town as the first 100% literate town in India in 1989. His national profile rose as the commissioner of the Delhi Development Authority. He demolished illegal buildings and reclaimed land worth more than 10,000 crore rupees. These actions earned him the title, the Demolition Man. Times of India survey showed that 89.6% of Delhiites supported his action, the highest rating for any public official any time. The action also listed him in Time magazine's 100 Young Global Leaders in 1994 cover story the 5th of December 1994. In 2006, he resigned from the IAS and entered politics by becoming an LDF supported independent member of the Legislative Assembly from Kanjirapali. On the 24th of March 2011, Alphonse joined the BJP in the presence of erstwhile party president Nitin Gudkari after having resigned from his assembly seat a couple of hours prior. He has been appointed as a member of Committee constituted by Government of India on 26 June 2017 to prepare the final draft of national education policy. In a cabinet reshuffle on 3 September 2017, he was appointed as Minister of State in the Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology and Minister of State independent charge of the Ministry of Tourism. On 9 November 2017, Alphonse was elected unopposed as Rajya Sabha member from Rajasthan. On 20 August he turned down the demand of Congress leaders to declare Kerala flood of 2018 as a national calamity and said there was no provision in the Disaster Management Act 2005 to do so. Alphonse's recent post on Facebook about Kerala flood in which he seemed to be sleeping in a relief camp, made him a target for trolls through social media. <laughs> 